To set up an ISOBUS joystick, master or 12 section switch boxes, TMR armrest or any other type of auxiliary ISOBUS control, press the ISOBUS soft key in the home screen. You will need to have the implement you want to control as well as the auxiliary control device connected, then press the auxiliary tab. If you have multiple implement ECUs connected, make sure the one you want to set up is shown in the implement box at the top of the display. Its programmable functions will be loaded and shown in the column on the left hand side. If doing a new setup, it's a good idea to remove any current assignments that may be present. Press the delete soft key in the top right corner of the display. A pop-up message will appear. Press yes to confirm. Next, we have to choose a function to program. Here we will start at the top with the master on off function. Tap on the middle column to select the auxiliary controller you want to use. You can have multiple auxiliary end controllers connected at the same time, such as a TMR armrest and a joystick or the section switch boxes. Select which one you want to use for this function here. In this case, we've only got the joystick connected. The third column allows you to select which button on the auxiliary controller you want to use for that function. Here we are going to assign the lower left button as the master switch. Repeat this process for any additional functions you want to remotely control. Another way to set these assignments is to press the learn button. This will remain black during the learning process. Next, select a function. Its row will turn orange. Then press the button you want to use on the auxiliary control itself. The second two boxes will automatically populate. Repeat this process for all the other functions you want to add. Regardless of which method you use to program the functions, you will need to press the Save soft key at the top of the display to save them into the Implements ECU. A pop-up message will appear. Press yes to proceed. Another message will appear confirming the key assignments were saved into the implements ECU. Press OK. You should be able to use the auxiliary control device now. You can view the auxiliary control device allocations at any time in the VT screen to confirm which buttons are assigned to which function. Thank <laughs> you.